For the new drug scandal rocking baseball, former MVP Ryan Braun has been suspended for the rest of the season. Alex Rodriguez of the Yankees could soon be slapped with an even stiffer punishment. And ABC's Paula Ferris has more on what this means for the game's biggest stars. Ryan Braun may be just the first to fall from grace. I hope that Ryan Braun is forever remembered as the most despicable liar in the history of baseball. Sources tell ABC's sister network ESPN that Yankees third baseman Alex Rodriguez is among roughly 20 major leaguers who may soon face suspension. They're being investigated for violating the league's drug policy, part of Major League Baseball's probe into biogenesis, a former anti-aging clinic in Florida that allegedly supplied players with performance-enhancing drugs. The movement in the investigation comes after Braun was suspended for the remainder of the season for using banned substances. Just last year, after failing a drug test, the All-Star looked into the camera and lied. If I had done this intentionally or unintentionally, I'd be the first one to step up and say, I did it. But this week, Braun finally fessed up, saying, I realize now that I have made some mistakes. I am willing to accept the consequences of those actions. Some players we spoke to believe that those violating the drug policy should be punished more severely. It has to hurt financial. We lied about it, got away with it, we tried to lie about it again, got caught, and still is making a hundred and some odd million dollars. If A-Rod is found guilty, both the punishment and the backlash could be even worse. Because according to ESPN, Major League Baseball allegedly has even more evidence against him than they did Braun. They want to know, did he actually tamper with witnesses? Did he try to have any documents destroyed? If that's the case, then that's going to mean a much heavier suspension than anybody else is going to, to face. Ed, when it comes to A-Rod, ESPN using the words lifetime bad, that's just how much evidence the league has on him, but there's a chance he could accept a plea deal, which he denied as recently as last week in Georgia. Sources close to the situation tell me Major League Baseball in the final stages of their investigation for everyone involved. Many more chips to follow. Okay, Paul, thanks very much. This could be huge.